What's up guys and welcome back. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to downgrade your iOS device from iOS 11.2 back to iOS 11.1.2. So the reason to do so, you're to increase your possibility to have a jailbreak. So a couple of days ago, there has been some news about an exploit that's going to be released by a security expert called I Am Bear. So he tweeted a couple of days ago, he is going to release an exploit that has to do with the iOS 11.1.2 firmware. And according to the jailbreak community, this exploit is 80% of the jailbreak. So we still need more hackers to compile some stuff in order to be 100% jailbreak. So now on to the downgrade process the first thing here is go to the settings scroll to display and brightness and go to the auto lock and set it to never then keep your device on the home screen and plug it to your computer next go to iTunes and make sure to back up your device Next, go to IPSW.me and look for the firmware of your device. So in my case here, I have an iPhone SE. And look for iOS 11.1.2. So you can see here the green sign means that Apple is still signing these firmwares. So if you see a red sign, like you see here below it means that you will no longer be able to downgrade to those specific firmwares so download iOS 11.1.2 once the download is finished go to iTunes and go here to check for update if you're on Mac hold the option key and right click if you are on Windows hold the shift key and right click next grab the firmware or choose the firmware that you have downloaded and hit update And we are back to iOS 11.1.2. Let me show you here on the settings. We go to about, as you can see here, 11.1.2. So keep in mind that this method is temporary. So once Apple stops signing this firmware, you will not be able to go back. That's it for this video guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't found new content. Thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next one.